Hey guys, what's up Aquarius? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, and the obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with, so flip it how you need to. Also, keep in mind it's a general reading, so take what's yours and leave the rest behind. All right, somebody's doing a lot of thinking, daydreaming, looking at pictures. All right, so make sure that if this does resonate, that you like and subscribe below. If you would, please, I appreciate it. All right, Aquarius. Ooh, a lot you are not seeing coming towards you. Could be dealing with a Pisces. If not, you may not see this coming. All right. Or you could be keeping it hidden. What you doing? Yeah, you may not see it coming because there's been a whole lot of nothing, it looks like. Um, I mean, a lot of something, but somebody is lonely as hell without you. But it's like they, they definitely do want to move forward, want to date, reconcile. A lot of passion here, like reignite some type of flame here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. But it looks like either you rejected the offer or they're afraid that you're going to reject it. Show me this five of pentacles because this is somebody, you know, feeling abandoned. Feeling breadcrumbs, feeling ghosted. This knight of wands. So there could have been an age difference. This could have been somebody who's in and out and you could have defended yourself towards that. With the seven of wands, you could have blocked them. Could have said no more. Pisces energy. There's that moon. King of Cups at the bottom. Double Cancer Scorpio. Um, cancer energy here. But it looks like there's an opportunity coming towards you. What? What's hidden? So with the moon, this person is is probably keeping their feelings hidden. It could be financial issues that they're having that's blocking this. Show me the moon. What's hidden? Kind of up in the air, weighing options, unsure. Could be at a distance, but this person's experiencing a lot of pain. With the Three of Swords and the Five of Pentacles um, and the Moon, that's deep emotions. Because it's like this person wants to come forward, but it looks like they're afraid that you're going to reject this. So even with the Moon, the Moon is all about, whoo, they are so up in their head, or this is you. Uh, I hope this isn't you. Because there's a peace card. So hopefully you're feeling at peace. But somebody has no idea what to do. Like the mind games, the mind fuckery that's around this. It's, I feel like there's anger. Somebody's cut off their intuition. Like they're losing sleep. A lot of stress here. But this goes deep. Because the moon is about our emotions. That's Cancer, Pisces, energy. But think about like how deep the, the, the ocean goes. So these emotions run deep. Um, somebody may have felt like they acted like a fool now because they're hurting. And it, it, like I said, this, this is probably being kept hidden. Show me the four of cups for Aquarius. So this could be a rejected offer. Um, the wheel so you could have rejected this offer it feels like if that's the case some type of karma was implemented um with the justice card that's libra energy but it really feels like um yeah see somebody's energy could have been pulled here and it's at the very least it's like you, you could have got fed up with the situation because you, you weren't getting back what you were putting in here um and that became exhausting Show me the magician. In some situations, um, yeah, see this King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, somebody wants to come back and apologize. Or may not apologize, but they want to come back in to your good graces because they still do have feelings here. But like I said, you could have rejected this cup or drinking from this cup was not even, it wasn't equal and that became exhausting. Um, definitely could have blocked it because somebody, somebody is shut down here. 
in some situations, I just want to tell you, um, if there's been like a job or a career that you've been trying to start or any kind of money issues, um, that could be balancing out. If somebody's been having money issues, they could be tired from, from that. It feels like more of the first, but we're just looking at it in, in terms of money. All right, show me this Knight of Cups because there are still romantic feelings. This person just may not have been expressing it possibly because you could have blocked them. Show me the Three of Pentacles. So this is that love offer coming forward, wanting to work together, wanting to collaborate because you do make them happy and somebody wants to fight for their happiness. Um... Show me the three of pentacles, though. You could work with this person. Yeah, see, want to build, want to grow, want to stabilize. But why the um, why the five of wands? They just want to fight for it. Virgo energy with the hermit, Cancer energy. It's like somebody does want to move forward. There's a lot of pain, a lot of regret around this. They do miss you, even though they're coming back slow as hell. Um, it looks like they do want to come back with a solid offer. Yeah, the Six of Cups. They want to return. And it looks like they are. Um, it may just be a slow-moving process. Yeah, reunion, celebrations, gathering, reconciliation. If this wasn't third party, somebody's just been really working on like a career, a finance thing. Mine's been on their money trying to build something stable. This was third party before and that's what became so exhausting because somebody was always back and forth and, you know, never giving like their undivided energy and attention and, and that became the struggle. They're coming back with... Um, and there are feelings behind it. There are happy, There is happiness behind it. But this could have been a married man with the King of Wands and the Four of Wands. There's still... Don't... It, it's still, like, at that dating level. Um, actually, it's still at that dating level. Like, it does It's not progressing right now. Um, although they probably want it to, it's not happening because of that third energy in the background. For some, though, if it was not third party, somebody could have just been having money issues and they're really working to bring some stability here. And they're coming back around the feelings. They're coming back around stability. They're getting to a point where they can kind of chill. All right, advice for Aquarius. Thank you. Wedding. The situation involves marriage. In that case, release your ex. The time has come to clear your energy. Okay, so what if someone has just been working? What if they've just been having money issues? New love. A new person has stirred your romantic feeling. Alright, so when I asked if... Um, you know, somebody just been working, having money issues. Soulmate, yes, this is your soulmate. Trust, the situation is calling for you to have faith. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner that you seek. Either way, I believe this person has feelings for you. It's just not. Um, yeah, in some situations, you got to pay attention to the red flags because there, there is a situation going on back here. Unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. And again, it's a general reading. So, you know, take that for what it is. Right now, if if you're um if you're looking forward to settle down, but there's been something like a marriage in the background or someone else in the background, it doesn't really settle. There is a lot of reconciliation, friendship, deep bonds, hanging out, celebrating, and there are feelings. It's just not ready to move forward at this time. All right, Aquarius, I hope this helped. I hope it resonated with you. 
They definitely want to come back. They want to talk to you. All right. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.